Now, earlier in the show, you heard the steam packet, which has been established for quite some time now. John, are uh, things working out as you hoped and planned? Oh, yes, Brian. In many, many ways, um, things are going very, very well at the moment. I think we've all developed tremendously musically mm -hmm. in the last year now, isn't it? Yes, yes a year. yeah. You've not as yet, Brian, um, mm -hmm. made a record together. Any of you? No, uh, we seem to run into uh, difficulties here because we're on different labels and there seems to be oh, a difference yeah. of opinion as to which label we should release yeah. the record. But uh, I th I'm sure that we'll probably get over all that very yeah. shortly. And, okay. Uh, we hope to put something out all together. Fine. John, tell us about your uh, record. This is, as we know, not with the Trinity or the Steam Packet. No, it's, it's with 1001 strings, more or less. <laughs> it's got such a big thing. It's a sort of almost Phil Spector type backing, which. Uh, a friend of mine called Bob Leeper arranged, <laughs> and he is a Leeper too. Um, and it's a song that was written by a, a group of, a very strange group of gentlemen in the States called the Strange Loves. Mm. They just wrote the uh, the Merz's hit, you know, the song yes. Sorrow. Yeah. And that's their tune as well. And this, what's yours called? It's called The Drifter. I see. Well, we haven't got the Leeper, so can we do it with the steamer? Yes. Yeah. Certainly, we'll have a go anyway. And I, and then I cry. 